Welcome to Sketchy. We take all the super complex stuff you need to learn and turn them into memorable visual stories packed full of everything you need to know on test day. Click the link in the corner or description to try for free for seven days. Now let's get to it. We're still in Alaska after our cholangiocarcinoma sketch, but this time we're out fishing on the high seas. Does this remind anyone of any popular Alaska fishing shows, perchance? We're here to discuss another rare but seriously bad news cancer, gallbladder adenocarcinoma. In the U.S., gallbladder cancer is particularly rare, though the prevalence in South American countries is much higher. The most important risk factor for gallbladder cancer is the presence of gallstones, which is thought to cause a chronic inflammatory state that can transform into cancer. Since you probably know someone with gallstones, or even have or used to have them yourself, don't sweat it. It's exceedingly rare. Even though gallstones are the most important risk factor for gallbladder cancer, only a fraction of 1% of patients with gallstones will develop cancer. Whoa, that's something delicious, is uh, fermenting in that fancy porcelain crock there. <laughs> Hope it's tied down. Seas can get rough, and we don't want to lose a drop. Chronic inflammation, i.e. chronic cholecystitis of the gallbladder, secondary to stones can lead to calcium accumulation within the gallbladder wall, causing the infamous porcelain gallbladder on the imaging. Porcelain gallbladder doesn't mean gallbladder cancer is present, but the risk of developing gallbladder cancer is higher than in patients without porcelain gallbladder. So, to the OR and out with a porcelain gallbladder.